Hello Tracker Man, uh, here's a hopefully a short video just to demonstrate some of the steps I covered in my post. Uh, in terms of printing and mounting the tissue that's already been covered, I just want to point out that uh, at this stage you may want to glue to the inside of the fuselage any uh, objects like the uh, cockpit interior and so forth. Uh, step number two, uh, again using a scrap fuselage I have here just to mention that since the paper plants are designed for thin paper uh, if you make any formers or firewalls and things like this you have to reduce these by the width of the Depron in this case uh, two millimeters all around. In terms of beveling the edges what I do for that is I have a sanding stick and I lay this fuselage or whatever side I'm going to do on the edge of a table and bevel in, sand in the required amount of bevel. After the bevel is in I take pastels and color the bevels so that when I do join pieces uh, any white foam will not be showing through. Step four was uh, bending and forming the pieces to do any bends. On the inside of the Depron I take a straight edge held at about a 45 degree angle and press into the foam that creates a nice trough in there which will allow me to bend the foam to any degree that I desire. See the outside has a nice bend and nothing is broken. In terms of the curve, for example, the front of the fuselage, I take a brass rod, cushion it in the palm of my hand, and roll it around like this to get the desired curve that I want. You'll notice that there's plenty of creases on the inside, but the outside is perfectly smooth. It works very, very nice. This is the way the uh, paper modeling group does it. Step number five to join things I use my favorite adhesive which is Yoohoo Pour but I want to show uh, point something out here. Uh, undoubtedly uh, if you're not very very careful there'll be some excess glue on the outside of the joints. If it's straight Depron I normally use Ronson lighter fuel to clean the Depron up however I just want to point out that if you use this Ronson lighter fuel or naphtha uh, with printed tissue uh, it's fine it won't affect the, the uh, tissue however it will dissolve the adhesive underneath the tissue and you'll end up something like this that you'll have to uh, put down again with a little bit more adhesive no big deal but I just want to point that out finally uh, once you're touching up, if you have any joints that are not perfect, you can take some light sandpaper and just on the edges sand those down and then use pastels to recolor the edge. Uh, again, pastels are pretty neat. I also use pastels with a brush if I want to do some weathering is that you can brush on to any degree uh, that you like so pretty neat anyway that's it pretty quick uh, hope you got something out of this